If blocked arteries are not treated, they can lead to stroke. But now doctors are treating blocked arteries in the neck with a less invasive procedure called carotid stenting. News 13's Jessica Foster has more in tonight's Modern Medicine Report. Carotid stenting requires only a small puncture hole in the groin or arm and a short hospital stay. And I guess I was lucky that I didn't have a stroke or heart attack one to one of the two. Carol Mays was experiencing what doctors call mini strokes. It was causing visual changes in her right eye. She had a 90, about 99 percent blockage on the right side of her um, uh, carotid, on the right carotid artery. You can see the blockage in this image. Dr. Samir Patel put a stent in to open up Carol's blockage. Instead of having surgery with a large incision in her neck, Dr. Patel was able to perform this less invasive procedure. Just like a heart catheterization, it's a little puncture wound, wound in the leg. Uh, that's where we pass all our equipment and our tubes and our sheaths and our stents. And once the procedure is done, everything comes out. We hold pressure there for about 15, 20 minutes and uh, she does well. Carol says she's now feeling great. I'd, I'd love to go dancing. Doctors say it's important to stay in close contact with a primary care physician so blockages can be found before they lead to stroke.